Imagine an iPhone being dropped into a blender. When the switch is turned on, the iPhone is blasted into small pieces that get pulverized into black dust. Blendtec brand blenders created a series of YouTube videos like this called Will It Blend? where they blend everything from electronics to golf balls. The series generated over 300 million views. Blendtec took one of the main selling points of its blenders, durability, and showcased it in a dramatic way. That made their blenders something people wanted to talk about, and this word of mouth increased sales by an amazing 700%. Nothing beats word of mouth to make products and ideas popular. It's the primary factor for up to 50% of all purchasing decisions and is 10 times as effective as traditional advertising. Why? When we hear about a great product from a friend, we tend to believe it. But when we see an ad, we tend to be skeptical. So how can we create word of mouth for our product? For over a decade, Jonah Berger, a professor of marketing at the Wharton School of Business, studied this question and identified six key principles that make products and ideas contagious. Six Principles of Contagiousness Social Currency What we talk about influences how others see us. If we know about remarkable things, like a blender that can tear through an iPhone, it makes us look interesting and we earn social currency. To get people talking about your product, give them something interesting to say. Almost every product is remarkable in some way. As Blendtec shows, even boring household products can be remarkable. Triggers. A trigger makes us think about something else. Peanut butter makes us think of jelly. Nestle triggered us to think of Kit Kat with their Kit Kat and coffee campaign. By the end of the year, sales had increased 8%. Emotion. When we care, we share. We feel compelled to spread the word about things that arouse our anger, excitement, and amazement. When an awkward and matronly woman dressed in what looked like an old set of drapes walked onto the stage of Britain's Got Talent, the audience snickered and rolled their eyes. But when Susan Boyle started to sing, the audience was overwhelmed with her talent. People cried and gave her a standing ovation. In just nine days, the clip of her performance got over 100 million views on YouTube. A powerful emotional response compelled people to pass it on. This word of mouth got her a recording contract and launched a hugely successful singing career that generated top-selling albums and multi-million dollar income. Public exposure. People are copycats. We look at what others are doing and follow their lead. That's why we walk past a deserted restaurant, but we'll wait for a table and a busy one. You can't copy something you can't see, so we need to make our products and ideas more visible so they can advertise themselves. Think of logos on brand name shirts and shopping bags. Practical value. People like to help others, so if we can offer something useful that will help make people's lives better, they will spread the word. How can we craft content with real practical value? People love articles that boil concepts down into useful information. That's why articles with titles like six tips for this or five strategies for that get shared a lot. Stories. People love to share stories. When 425 pound Jared Vogel decided to lose weight, he started a Subway diet. Almost every day he ate a foot long veggie sub for lunch and a six inch turkey sub for dinner. What's amazing is he lost 245 pounds by eating fast food. People don't like to talk about Jared because they want to help Subway, but Subway still benefits. You can't tell the story about Jared without delivering messages like Subway offers healthy options that can help you lose weight. And that is the magic of stories. Information travels in an entertaining package. Generating word of mouth isn't just dumb luck. Use these principles to make your products and ideas contagious.